Ms. Ksana. My husband and I have a six-year-old daughter, Mistenka. She is a very sociable and active girl. She has a lot of friends and girlfriends in the kindergarten and in our yard. That's just about how they play in the yard, and we will talk. Recently there was such an incident. Nasty with the guys were playing in the yard, and I was cooking dinner and watching them through the kitchen window. I had already cooked dinner, and for some reason Nasya did not go home. I decided to go out into the yard and get her. I didn't want to shout from the window so as not to disturb anyone. I went out into the yard and froze on the spot. In the hands of my daughter was a bundle, very much like a bundle with a small child. A bunch of thoughts immediately raced through my head. Where did a baby get such a small baby? Where is its mother? And the role at this time has already taken away from Nastya her friend Anya with the words. Give me that. You're holding it wrong. I went closer and looked closely. I calmed down. I saw a long and fluffy cat's tail out of the scraps of fabric. It was clear. The girl swaddled a cat. How he did not scratch them. Mommy. It's our daughter. Joyfully told me Nastya. Girls. What are you doing? This big cat could really scratch you. Where did you even take it? I shouted. Meanwhile, the cat was very happy with life. He was lying quietly in Alia's arms. I realized that the girls were lulling our local backyard cat, Vasca. So it's a cat. So he cannot be your daughter. It can. You call me kitty sometimes. Said Nastya. And let's let him out. What if it hurts? No. He's fine. He even purrs so nice. I'm a doctor, and came to see your daughter said Katyusha importantly. Give me my patient here. The cat meows. He must be tired of inactivity, and wanted to run. He looked at me with pitying eyes, and I realized that it is necessary to save him. Your daughter and Fisco very sleepy. Keisha came to her verdict, acting as a doctor. Girls. And let me help you rock your baby. I said. Cat you gave me the cat. I quickly and deftly unwound the cloth and let him out. Vasco rushed across the yard and hid in the basement of our house. Oh, he ran away. What do we do now? Alia said sadly. And he told me that a little run, a mouse will catch and come back to you. Really? Oh, how nice. Mastinka, let's go home. It's dinner time. I said, and took my daughter by the hand. Come on, let's go home. We went home. And Nastya's friends were already coming over to our new tenants who had a big and very beautiful dog, a Dalmatian. It must be their new live toy. And in general, all the guys in our yard are very kind and don't hurt anyone. But you can't get bored with them. Thank you.